comes the radio guy. With all new audio content for the broadcast industry. With voiceover talent, John Gale. Hello, hello, welcome, welcome, welcome everybody to a a Thursday edition of the Radio Guy. I'm John Gale and we'll be doing some audio production over the next 60 minutes or so as we do every single weekday at 11.30 Eastern Standard Time. You can check us out on YouTube as well as, of course, on Facebook live stream. Give us a little thumbs up and if you are involved in radio broadcasting, audio editing, digital audio production, anything like that, give us a little thumbs up and Comment in the comment section below. Let us know where you're watching from, what city, what state, what nation. We would love to engage with you a little bit today and tell you thanks for watching and show our love to you. That's that's what we do each and every day. We do some um, voiceover work. That's right. I've been a voiceover artist for the last mm -hmm, 25, 30 years or so. And uh, today we're going to be doing some voiceover work for some weather casts for radio stations across the United States for about 15 different stations today, from Florida to Texas, from Ohio and New York to Wyoming and Kansas and all over the place, really. So stay tuned if you like that kind of thing. This is the place that you need to be. Yes, sir, Bob. Hey, you can check us out on YouTube now. We've got our own YouTube channel, The Radio Guy. Just search for us there. Once you find the channel, you hit the red subscribe button. And you'll get notifications just like you do when you follow us on Facebook Live. You'll be the first to know when we load up brand new video content to the to the live stream. So thanks for being here today. We appreciate it. We're going to get started with our very first uh, radio voiceover production today. It is for K-Hat Radio. K-Hat is located in Wyoming, Wyoming, Wyoming. Uh, let's see, it is for Cheyenne and for Laramie, a dual read for them. And they've got their own jingle bed that I'm opening right now in our digital audio workstation, Adobe Audition CS 2020. You may be familiar with Photoshop or Illustrator, something like that. This is Adobe Audition CS 2020, part of the Creative Suites package. It is a premier audio editing software package. And in track one, you'll see the weather bed for K-Hat FM Radio. And in the second track, let's see, it doesn't look like it's populating just yet. Let's go ahead and close this uh, multi-track session template out and open up a brand new one again for K-Hat. Sometimes it glitches like that. I don't know why, but it does. There we go. We'll start our recorder. You can see right behind my head, give you a little better view here. This is Adobe Audition, the uh, track two, highlighting in red there, the little waveform that's taking place. That is my voice uh, right now in real time. And let's see, this forecast is going to be airing this afternoon between 4 and midnight mountain time out there in Wyoming uh, on 96.7 FM KHAT. Let's put 24 seconds on the clock for this one. I'm a part of the RFN uh, network, the Radio Forecast Network. We're a group of voiceover artists. Some of us are meteorologists and uh, broadcast professionals, and we produce weather casts, forecasts for Oh, gosh, over 200 radio stations across the United States and uh, and all of their day parts. So morning drive, middays, afternoons, evenings, overnights. So lots of forecasts, literally thousands of forecasts every single day. I don't do all of those. No, I only do about 15 of them each day. So there's a lot of us doing them. We're going to get started with this one. This one. This one. Yes, indeed. Let's look at the forecast view and let you see this up close and personal. We're going to start with our open. This is uh, what I see to do my weather cast each and every day. The dual read here is the same today for both cities of Laramie and Cheyenne. Sometimes uh, they're far enough apart that we have to do them separately, but today they're close enough together, just a difference of four degrees or so. So we'll we'll say in, in the range there when we actually do the forecast. So we'll start with tonight, Friday, Friday night, and that'll probably be about it. And then we'll finish up with this close right here. All right, 24 seconds. Let's give her a shot and start our recorder, <clears throat> start our timer rather, right now. Here we go. From the new country 96.7 Weatherbug Weather Center for Laramie and for Cheyenne tonight. Partly cloudy skies and blustery, very chilly with a low in the mid-20s. Friday brings sunny skies still a bit breezy with a high near 60. And mostly clear Friday evening a bit breezy as well with a low temperature in the mid-40s. From new country 96.7, I'm John Gale. Have a great night. All right, we're a little shy. Let's do it one more time. Stretch it just a bit. Here we go. Reset the clock. Let's start our timer again. 
From the new Country 96.7 Weatherbug Weather Center for Laramie and for Cheyenne tonight. Partly cloudy skies with some blustery winds out of the north. A bit chilly with a low temperature of 24 degrees. It'll be sunny and breezy again on your Friday. Winds out of the southwest, a high near 60 and mostly clear Friday evening, a low temperature of 43. From New Country 96.7, I'm John Gale. Have a great night. All right, that one looks pretty good right there. Let's go ahead and use it. We'll switch over here to the Adobe Editing Large Screen View and let you see the process as we use our razor tool and trim out the actual forecast voiceover, which, uh, let's see, voiceover for the forecast is going to start right there. We'll delete everything else and drag this voiceover back, lining it up directly underneath the music bed, which is in track one. You can see the stinger start here, and it begins to fade. That's where we want the voiceover to begin. This is called a donut in radio broadcasting. There's a stinger in the front, stinger in the back, and a hole in the middle for the voiceover. That's where we want to place the uh, the reed there, as we call it. Now, I went a little bit long on this, so I'm going to come in a bit earlier. And I might even trim out a... Uh, let's go ahead and do that. We're going to trim out a breath here. A long breath. Looking for a long breath. Here's a pretty decent one right here. So we'll trim right there. Just going to do a crossfade, basically, right there over the intake of the breath. I'm going to zoom in a little bit tighter because it's kind of tight. And show you again here. Right about there works well, okay? And let's see where that gets us. Yeah, that's pretty good. All right, let's go ahead and bounce down both these audio files together, making a brand new one, combining them, mixed together the moist, the voice, the moist voiceover, and the music bed. Now we'll add some mastering and effects. Here we want to welcome Anita Dakin and our favorite top fan of the radio guy. It's Steve Bellinger. Thanks, guys, for tuning in. So glad you're watching today. Glad you're with us. Top fans, hey, what can you say, you know? All right, scrolling to the front, we're going to take out the little uh, dead air on the very top so it triggers right away. And again, here on the uh, back side, same thing there. All right, let's go ahead and audition this puppy. Let's hear what it sounds like. Here we go. Yeah, baby. From the new Country 96.7 Weatherbug Weather Center for Laramie and for Cheyenne tonight, partly cloudy skies with some blustery winds out of the north, a bit chilly with a low temperature of 24 degrees. It'll be sunny and breezy again on your Friday. Winds out of the southwest, a high near 60, and mostly clear Friday evening, a low temperature of 43. From New Country 96.7, I'm John Gale. Have a great night. All right, you see how that sounded right there in the middle when you stuck it right between the two stingers? It works perfectly. That's how you need to do it. That's a uh, textbook example right there. We're going to switch over here to the tiny cam view. Go ahead and let's uh, get ready to export this file. Control Shift E in Windows brings up the uh, export file for Adobe Audition CS 2020. We're just going to name it the file name that uh, that we've been asked to name it here, and that is going to be KHAT FM EV. Just copying and pasting it basically here into the export file window. Okay, there she goes, overriding. Yesterday's forecast, because like we say here on the Radio Guy, on a regular basis, nobody cares about yesterday's weather. Okay, hat is in the can. Let's go ahead and find it now as the MP3 that we just saved it for Wyoming. And it's going to be here up at the top. Okay, hat FMEV. There it is. Okay. It populates and now we'll FTP it. We will file transfer protocol that MP3 right over the internet directly into their automation computer in Wyoming where it will trigger then between 4 and midnight tonight. Now we're going to move on to their sister station, KIMX, a different format, a CHR format here, for KMX Radio. So we'll open up, of course, a different multi-track template session that includes their jingle, my favorite jingle of all of them today. Bob Minter's eating a donate, a donate, a donate. He's donating a donut. Woohoo! Welcome, Bob. Oh my goodness. I'm getting flustered. You brought up donuts, and I got all excited. I just had some bacon. I just want to say I cooked it a little too long, a little too crunchy for me, but I like my bacon crisp. I don't like limp bacon. Who likes limp bacon? Nobody. All right, same read, dual read for. Laramie and Cheyenne, Wyoming. So we're going to go ahead and put uh, 26 seconds on the clock for this one, okay? Again, airing today between 4 and midnight Mountain Time. Let's give her a shot. A shot of Rooney. A shoot of Rooney Doody. Here we go. From the Weatherbug Weather Center for southeastern Wyoming, for Laramie and for Cheyenne tonight, partly cloudy skies, a bit blustery with some winds out of the north gusting up. 
quite a bit, as high as 30 miles per hour. Our low temperature in the mid-20s. Sunny and breezy on your Friday, a high near 60, and mostly clear Friday night, still windy with a low around 43. I'm John Gale on Wyoming's number one hit music station. All right, and that is a one take for KIMX FM in Cheyenne, Wyoming. Okay, let's go ahead and trim it out using our razor tool. I hope you are enjoying what you're watching right now. <laughs> That's why you're watching it, I hope. And we are doing some audio production, some live radio broadcast production that we do every single weekday. If you just tuned in wondering what in the world's going on, look at the Pac-Man emoji love happening. Nice and big emojis today. I can't even reach them because they're behind my head. All righty. Enough of that. Oh, come on now. Stop. All right. So we will... Uh, <laughs> we're going to scroll back the voiceover again as we line up. We like to have fun here on the radio, guy. Is that okay? We're allowed to have some fun. Eating donuts from Tim Hortons. I mean, come on. Canadian Canadian uh, Tim Hortons. We've got, I've got a Tim Hortons right here in my town. Uh, right here, Right here in Dayton, Ohio area. We go there often. There's a few of them here in southwestern Ohio. All right, we're going to go ahead and let's line up the voiceover directly as the fade-out happens. Unmute the music bed. Bounce down both these audio files together as one. Yes, combining them in holy matrimony forever. Never to be divorced uh, until they delete the file. And it looks like we've overmodulated a little bit on our voiceover. Let's add some mastering and effects and take a listen here to the finished product. Here we go. Yeah, baby. I'm from the Weatherbug Weather Center for southeastern Wyoming, for Laramie, and for Cheyenne tonight, partly cloudy skies, a bit blustery with some winds out of the north gusting up quite a bit, as high as 30 miles per hour. Our low temperature in the mid-20s. Sunny and breezy on your Friday, a high near 60, and mostly clear Friday night, still windy with a low around 43. I'm John Gale on Wyoming's number one hit music station. All right, sounds really good. Nice read for KIMX. Uh, very conversational. We'll go ahead and trim off the ends here as they fade out. Just triggering it up a little bit tighter for them. Nice and tight, especially when you're on a, CH a CHR format. you got to be tight, right? All right, let's name it and claim it. KIMX. KIMX is in the can. We're just waiting for the uh, FTP page to populate. Here we go. KIMX FM EV. Going to switch to the uh, tiny cam view and let you see that as we... Export, export, as we export, as we export KIMX FM EV, override of yesterday's forecast, and now we will look for it, the MP3, that is, for KIMX Radio. Right up at the top here, come on now, Johnny G, where'd you go? Oh, uh, I lost my KIMX. I'm just flying through fast, too fast, through fast. Man, my lips are just not ahead of my brain today. <laughs> One of those days. On time, good job. That file's over there in their automation computer. We can move on now. Mm, wake up, Johnny G. It's in Palatka, Florida, WPLK. This is a uh, nostalgia station for, what, East Central Florida, I guess it is, Palatka, Florida. We're going to go ahead and open up a multi-track template session that we pre-created uh, many moons ago that includes their jingle bed there in track one of Adobe Audition and track two, my voiceover highlighting in red in real time. This forecast begins this, uh, this evening between 6 and 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for uh, 800 a.m. and 98.3 FM WPLK. Let's put uh, 30 seconds on the clock. Here we go. From the WPLK Weatherbug Weather Center for tonight, partly cloudy skies, some calm winds out of our east, and a low temperature right around 68. It'll be mostly sunny and warm on your Friday, a high reaching 88, with mostly clear skies expected again Friday evening, calm winds out of the north, a low temperature around 66. Sunny again on your Saturday, a nice day, a high near 81. I'm John Gale from the station that plays everything, WPLK 898.3, Palatka. All right, and that, my friends, yes, indeed, is a one-take Chotty G that we like to celebrate. Yes, we do. With a little confetti cannons and some New Year's Eve horns and clapping and applause and all kinds of obnoxious stuff like that, just because those, uh, those one-take voiceovers are few and far between. All right, we're going to go ahead and trim out the uh, VO here. Again, as we do each and every time as we do the uh, voiceover productions. Oh, thank you for the Pac-Man emoji. Love. I appreciate it greatly. I can't even reach him. All 
All right, enough of that. That that, that uh, quickly fades into the sunset, doesn't it? Okay, we're gonna unmute the music bed from the voiceover. Uh, the music bed, yeah, from the voiceover track uh, uh, on top of it there. <laughs> yeah, we'll bounce down both the audio files together as one, mixing them together and adding some mastering and effects. Let's take a listen to PLK's finished product. Here we go. From the WPLK Weatherbug Weather Center for tonight, partly cloudy skies, some calm winds out of our east, and a low temperature right around 68. Yes. It'll be mostly sunny and warm on your Friday, a high reaching 88, with mostly clear skies expected again Friday evening, calm winds out of the north, a low temperature around 66. Sunny again on your Saturday, a nice day, a high near 81. I'm John Gale from the station that plays everything, WPLK 898.3, Palatka. A great read, if I do say so myself, today. They are just sounding nice and professional, if I don't say so myself. All right, we're just scrolling back to the front here and deleting out the uh, dead air. So it will trigger right on time. Control-Shift-E again, the shortcut. The shortcut to bring up um, the export file block. Uh, Anita Day can ask what we're drinking today. Uh, I don't know. A little vodka, a little rum and coke. This morning in my coffee makes me poop mug. No, we've got some Kroger brand French vanilla Keurig cups. Mild version. With some peppermint mocha international delight. Or whatever you call that cream. That creamer. It's the elf version with the peppermint mocha on it. My favorite new creamer. This time of year, anyway. I don't like that pumpkin junk. You know, whoever decided that pumpkin spice was a good thing is insane. I mean, pumpkin pie is good, and that's about it. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what it is about pumpkin spice. I'll drink, I, you know, occasionally, I might drink one Starbucks pumpkin spice a year. And that, I won't even finish it. Because it's way too pumpkin-y for me. Pumpkin and coffee? Ew, no. All right, on time that the FTP has gone on to uh, Palatka, Florida. We're going to move on from Florida to Cincinnati. WCVX is up next. We're going to close out this multi-track session template for Florida and open up a new, w, uh, new one for WCVX. <laughs> that includes their jingle there in track one. Actually, I have not tried the oat milk yet. Anita, would you quit pushing the oat milk? Okay, so I have some great energy today. I have to say, I was sluggish this morning. Yes, believe it or not. Johnny G was sluggish today. And I took this great stuff from Max International. No, no, no. Don't know if you've ever heard of Max International, but they make an ATP product. And I don't know what ATP stands for. There's a long terminology for it. We can look it up here online. ATP meaning, um, and it's for your health. You know, it, it kind of, uh, it, cre it helps you to create glutathione, basically. It's indocine triphosphate. Yes, indonosine triphosphate. Anyway, it's called ATP. And it, it really builds your energy in a quick fashion. And it's great. I love it. And as you can tell, it really works for me. All right, let's get started with CVX. <laughs> Coffee and a little ATP. Maybe I shouldn't have mixed them. From the News Talk, 1160 AM station. 30-second read for this one as my neighbor walks his cute two dogs. I just saw him walk by my window. I got a window right there. Mm -hmm. 30 seconds. Here we go. Long promotional close for Ket Moy. Let's go ahead and show you that view in the forecast view here. Starting up at the top. Here we go. Beginning our timer right now. From the Christian Talk 1160 Weatherbug Center for tonight. A chance of showers early on, then cloudy. This one's going to be in the record books, guys. One more read. Here we go. From the Christian Talk 1160 Weatherbug Center for tonight. A chance of showers early on. Mostly cloudy skies gradually becoming clear by morning. Our low temperature around 38. It'll be sunny and chilly on your Friday, our high only reaching 59, but mostly clear skies expected Friday night, a low of 35 degrees. This weather has been brought to you by Ketmoy, providing design, printing, and promotion services, 513-867-8800. From the Christian Talk 1160 Weatherbug Center, I'm John Gale. Yeah, baby, you need some ATP. That is for certain. Boo, yeah. Booyah. Booyah, booyah. All right, guys, we're going to switch over here to our different view and let you see the editing process. Let's uh, do that now. We've got the razor tool. We've trimmed out the voice over on the end. Here's the start, it looks like, right there. 
trim off the front end of that puppy, highlight and get rid of everything else. We'll scroll back our voiceover, line it up directly underneath the music bed, bounce down both these audio files together as one, add some mastering and effects, and let's take a listen. From the Christian Talk 1160 Weatherbug Center for tonight, a chance of showers early on, mostly cloudy skies gradually becoming clear by morning, our low temperature around 38. It'll be sunny and chilly on your Friday. Guess our what high I only hear. reaching 59. Do you hear any music? Me neither, guys. That's because we didn't mute. We didn't unmute the music bed. Gotta do it again. Here we go. Bounce down. Add the effects. Okay, here it comes. From the Christian Talk 1160 Weatherbug Center for tonight, a chance of showers early on. Mostly cloudy skies gradually becoming clear by morning. Our low temperature around 38. It'll be sunny and chilly on your Friday. Our high only reaching 59, but mostly clear skies expected Friday night a low of 35 degrees. This weather has been brought to you by Ketmoy, providing design, printing, and promotion services, 513-867-8800. From the Christian Talk 1160 Weatherbug Center, I'm John Gale. Okay, we're just going to share a little bit, and we ask you to share, too. If you are uh, especially involved in some radio group pages on Facebook, we've got a few that we are involved in, so I'm going to switch to that view and let you see it a little up close here. So we share with a little arrow button in Facebook. I'm just going to type in the, uh, something to say here. Live radio broadcast production. Radio. Radio broadcast. If I could type faster, I'd be happy. Production. And we'll save it. Let's see. Let's save it to small market radio. Radio swap spotters. Let's go to the voiceover community. Promote your internet radio show or podcast Online radio shows, Mr. Aircheck, and radio imaging and production. All right, that looks good. And as some folks begin to trickle in, we want to welcome you. We want to welcome you to the Radio Guy. Thank you all for tuning in. We're glad that you're with us today. If you are just uh, checking us out on Facebook, we do live radio broadcast production each and every weekday at 1130 Eastern Standard Time. We're just finishing up this file for WCVX, a Cincinnati station here. And we want to trim off the ends, make sure that this trigger is nice and tight for WCVX here. So we'll delete off the ends of these where the music fades and all is missing. There we go. We'll get rid of that one as well. Control Shift E is our shortcut to save the MP3 in this case to our E drive out of Adobe Audition CS 2020. Uh, the file name WCVX AMEV, overriding yesterday's forecast. We will look for it in our E drive. Uh, WCVX, the AM radio station out there in Cincinnati, where we just made this MP3 of their weather forecast right here. Open it up, and off she goes via file transfer protocol right over the internet into their automation computer on time. Good job, and it will trigger then tonight between 6 and midnight. And we're going to move on across the street to another Cincinnati AM station, WGRI Inspiration 1050. This one also has a jingle bed that we will open up on a pre-created multi-track template session that we made many, many months ago. In track one, you'll see the music bed for WGRI's weather. And in track two, my voice highlighting in red in real time. This is a 24-second read airing today between 6 and midnight. Eastern Standard Time Christian News Talk Inspiration 1050. We've got a frost, a frost advisory in effect. Look at that until 9 a.m. tomorrow morning. Okay, so we want to say that right off the bat. Let's switch to the forecast view and let you see that a little closer. Here we go. 24 seconds and let's begin. Frost advisory, correct? Get off there. Thank you. Frost advisory till tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. Here we go. From the Inspiration 1050 Weatherbug Center for tonight, that frost advisory in effect until 9 a.m. tomorrow morning. Otherwise, tonight, a chance of some showers early on, gradually becoming clear by morning, our low temperature around 38. It'll be sunny on your Friday, chilly, naha, naha, reaching high, naha. All right, one more. Here we go. From the Inspiration 1050 Weatherbug Center for tonight, that frost advisory in effect until 9 a.m. tomorrow. Otherwise, a chance of showers early on tonight, gradually becoming clear by morning. Our low temperature right around 38. It'll be sunny and cool. Oh, I'm having trouble with that sunny and cool thing today. All right, come on now, Johnny G. ATP kick in, will you? From the Inspiration 1050 Weatherbug Center for tonight, that frost advisory in effect tonight until... What's the timing on that, guys? What did it say? 9 a.m. Yeah, I thought so. Frost advisory. 
From the Inspiration 1050 Weatherbug Center for tonight, that frost advisory in effect until tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. Otherwise, tonight, a chance of some showers early on, gradually becoming clear by morning. Our low temperature right around 38. Sunny and cool for your Friday, a high only reaching 59 and clear Friday night, a low of 35. From the Inspiration 1050 Weatherbug Center, I'm John Gale. All right, that's the read that we want. <laughs> Finally, we get there. And we're going to switch over to the Adobe Editing View and trim up the voiceover. Here we go. Getting rid of everything else and all the mistakes in between. Here's the front of the voiceover, the last forecast that we corrected. Scroll back, our voiceover lined it up directly underneath the music bed in track one, and now we'll bounce down both audio files together, combining them into one brand new one, the music and the voiceover mixed. Add some mastering and effects, and let's take a listen to the finished product. Here we go. From the Inspiration 1050 Weatherbug Center for tonight, that frost advisory in effect until tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. Otherwise, nice. tonight, a chance of some showers early on, gradually becoming clear by morning. Our low temperature right around 38. Sunny and cool for your Friday, a high only reaching 59 and clear Friday night, a low of 35. Yes. From the Inspiration 1050 Weatherbug Center, I'm John Gale. All right, looks good. A nice little fade out right there that we're going to get rid of with our trimming and our razor tool. A little dead head in the front end that we need to fix. And now we'll switch to the tiny cam view here and name it and claim it. W-G-R-I-A-M. EV for evening and overriding yesterday's forecast. Nobody cares about yesterday's weather. I don't want a folder full of forecasts for Cincinnati's weather, right? We just want one. And WGRI is all ready to roll. There it is. Unless it's really a funny one that we want to keep, right? All right, via FTP file transfer protocol, that MP3 is going over the internet to Cincinnati. We can move on to Florida now. Chiefland, Florida, WTBH is up next. It's the next signal on the list for today's edition of the Radio Guy. We're doing some live radio broadcast production, in case you wondered. And WTBH is next up, an FM signal, a Christian FM signal called uh, Joyful Sounds Radio 91.5 FM. Let's put 30 seconds on the clock for this one airing tonight between 6 and midnight Eastern Standard Time. Here we go. Starting our timer now. I'm John Gale with your WTBH forecast for tonight. Partly cloudy skies, some calm winds, and a low temperature right around 63. It'll be mostly sunny and warmer on your Friday, a high reaching 88, and clear skies expected Friday night. Calm winds out of the north and a low temperature around 63. Sunny again on your Saturday, a high reaching 83, and clear skies for Saturday night, a low of 66 degrees. That's the latest forecast from 91.5 FM. I'm John Gale for Joyful Sounds Radio. All right, some weird, some weird little things going on with my voice on that one. A little flubby deer, a little flubby deer. But we're gonna trim it out and see what it sounds like underneath the, uh, with the music bed on top, underneath rather. Yep. So we're gonna trim it out, switch to the Adobe Editing View. Maybe I need to cut back on the ATP and unmute the music bed. Bounce down both the audio files together. Adding some mastering effects. We'll trim off this uh, jingle bed here and fade it out before we send it to Florida. Let's listen to what we've got so far. Here we go. I'm John Gale with your WTBH forecast for tonight. Partly cloudy skies, some calm winds, and a low temperature right around 63. It'll be mostly sunny and warmer on your Friday, a high reaching 88, and clear skies expected Friday night. Calm winds out of the north and a low temperature around 63. Sunny again on your Saturday, a high reaching 83, and clear skies for Saturday night, a low of 66 degrees. That's the latest forecast from 91.5 FM. I'm John Gale for Joyful Sounds Radio. Not bad, we'll keep it. It's fine. We'll trim off the rest of that. And as you can see, I left a little bit of jingle there that I need to fade out. How am I going to do that? We'll switch to the cam right view if my... Uh, if my computer will trigger that. Come on now, cam right view. It's not popping up. Not populating. We're having some trouble with my X-Split Elgato Stream Deck. We'll switch to the tiny cam view instead here. All right, adding the fade out. This is how we do it. We go up to the top under favorites. We'll scroll down to fade out. Whatever we've highlighted there in the in the WAV file. Trim that or hit the button for fade out. We've got a perfect fade. Right there. Good. All right, scroll back to the front of the forecast. Make sure that there's no dead air at the very top so it triggers right into it and control shift E exports the file. We're going to make it an MP3 here, motion picture export group file. 
And we're going to find it and send it on its way to Florida. WTBH is in the can. There we go. Okay, open it up, and off she goes via the Internet. On time, good job. We're going to move on from Florida to Dallas, Texas. KKGM, a dry read for Fort Worth and, Ta and Dallas both. Huge signal here. KKGM has no jingle bed, so it's just my voice. My melodious, velvet-coated voice. Right. 20 seconds on the clock for this one, airing today between 3 and 6 p.m. Uh, Central Standard Time on a Southern Gospel format here. Here we go. A little snotty today, forgive me. From the 1630 KKGM Weatherbug Weather Center, as we head into the evening, partly cloudy skies with some gusting winds out of our north-northeast, a low temperature around 52. It'll be sunny and nice on your Friday, a high only reaching 73, and clear skies expected Friday night, light winds out of the south-southeast, and a low... Screwed up on that one. Yes, I did. I screwed up. <laughs> All right, reset the clock. One more read. Here we go, starting the clock. From the 1630 KKGM Weatherbug Weather Center for tonight as we head into the evening. Partly cloudy skies with some gusting winds out of our north-northeast, a low temperature around 52. It'll be sunny and beautiful on your Friday, a high reaching 73, and clear skies expected Friday night. Light winds out of the south-southeast, a low temperature of 52 degrees. That's the read that we want, gang. Yes, it is. We'll switch over to the Adobe Editing Large Screen View and trim it up using the razor tool. Here we go. Trim, trimmery, trim, trimmery, trim, trim, true. If you're just now tuning in, we're doing some live radio broadcast production on the Radio Guy as we do each and every weekday at 1130 Eastern Standard Time. Make sure you say hi in the comment section if you're involved in radio broadcasting, audio editing, podcasting, internet radio, anything like that. We'd love to engage with you a little bit and talk and create some relationships. That's that's what makes it fun. From the 1630 KKGM Weatherbug Weather Center for tonight as we head into the evening. Partly cloudy skies with some gusting winds out of our north-northeast, a low temperature around 52. It'll be sunny and beautiful on your Friday, a high reaching 73 and clear skies expected Friday night. Light winds out of the south-southeast, a low temperature of 52 degrees. All right, let's see. Bob asks, uh, Bob says, ever grab those square block thingies for the fade in, fade out? I do not. I like, I like the old fashioned way. Feel more in command. I don't know. No, I don't. no, I don't. I don't know why. Just you know, you get in a habit, and that's how you do it. Control Shift E, the shortcut again, and we'll switch to the tiny cam view. Going to name it here and claim it. KKGM Dallas, Texas. Uh, MADR is what we need to call it here. Copy and pasting, basically. Control V, Control C, that kind of fun stuff. Naming it and overriding yesterday's, finding it here in the E drive, and we'll send it on its way to Texas. H I J K, there it is. H I J K K G N. There we go. Okay. Open it up, and off she goes via file transfer protocol uh, to Dallas, Texas. We're going to move on to K I U L. K I U L's in the K uh, K G M's in the can. We're going to open up. KIUL's forecast here. Close out Dallas, Texas multi-track template session. This is another dry read. I could have left it open. I just created another session that I didn't need to create, but that's okay. There it is. All righty. Frost advisory again. Let's see frost advisory at 9 a.m. Saturday morning. Uh, this airs tonight, 6 to midnight. Eastern Standard. No, 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 no. Central Standard Time for Wichita, Kansas. Here we go. 30 seconds on the clock for this puppy. Let's see what we get. Start the clock. Start the timer now. Here's your western Kansas weather for this evening. Mostly cloudy skies, some light winds out of the east, northeast becoming north by morning, and a low temperature of 33. Patchy frost expected on your Friday, burning off by around 8 a.m., becoming sunny and breezy with a high near 67. Mostly clear Friday night, breezy again with a low around 43, and sunny on your Saturday with a high of 79. Mostly clear Saturday night, a low of 36 from the Weather Center. I'm John Gale. All righty, a good one take read for KIUL AM. We're a little shy of our 30 second read, so we're going to trim it tight and uh, kind of do some digital stretching here. I believe this is the. Top. See what we get? Start the clock. Here we go. The start of the forecast. Trim it right there. Get rid of everything else. Just highlight and delete. Bounce down to a new audio file. Add some mastering and effects. Zooming in again real tight. Mm-hmm. Real tight. There we go. 
on the front side and on the back side. You can see, yeah, we're not even at uh, we're 29.3, 29.380. We'll go up to our, let's see, how do we do this? Let's go to the effects tab, time and pitch, stretch and pitch, new duration. That's what we want. I'm going to make it a 30. All right, so we got to hit our nums lock and type right into this. This always gives me grief. Very irritating, gang. There we go. Hit apply and boom shakalaka boom, a perfect 30. Let's audition it and see what it sounds like for KIUL. Here we go. Here's your Western Kansas weather for this evening. Mostly cloudy skies, some light winds out of the east, northeast becoming north by morning, and a low temperature of 33. Patchy frost expected on your Friday, burning off by around 8 a.m., becoming sunny and breezy with a high near 67. Mostly clear Friday night, breezy again with a low around 43, and sunny on your Saturday with a high of 79. Mostly clear Saturday night, a low of 36 from the Weather Center. I'm John Gale. Here's Good read there for KIUL. Let's scroll back to the front. Mm, don't have to trim it because we already did all the trimming ahead of time. I forgot about that. KIUL's in the can for Western Kansas, Wichita, Scott Lane, Sublet City, Scott City. Overriding yesterday's forecast, we'll look for it here in the E-Drive and send it on its way via FTP as an MP3 file. We're going to be doing some um, voice tracking work for TNNRadio.com, a country radio station coming up. I do the Sunday afternoon evening shift from 4 to 8 p.m. there. Check us out online. I'll put a, a link here in the comments section. It is, let's see, HTTP, TNNRadio.com. And on time, good job. We are ready to roll on to our next station on the list, which is KULH. KULH is in Brookfield, Missouri. We're going to close out this template we just finished for Wichita. And the Wichita lineman, Glenn Campbell. Good stuff from the 70s, man. What an incredible musician. I talk about him every chance that I can get. Glenn Campbell. Recording there. You know, he is on most, a lot of uh, rock and roll records in the um, 50s and 60s, even, as a guitar guitar solo. All right, we've got our music bed in track one for KULH, my voiceover in track two for The Wave. This is a CCM station, Contemporary Christian Radio Station. This forecast will be airing tonight, or rather this afternoon, between 3 and 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. We'll put uh, 28 seconds on the clock for this puppy, and let's see what we've got for KULH. Starting our timer now. From the Wave Weather Center, I'm Weatherbug Weathercaster John Gale. As we head into the evening, mostly clear skies expected, light and variable winds. Our low temperature around 37. Sunny and chilly on your Friday, a high only reaching 59 with some gusting winds out of the west, northwest. Partly cloudy skies expected Friday night, still a bit gusty with a low temperature around 42. And sunny on Saturday, a high of 70. That's the latest look at the latest that's a look at the latest weather information from the Wave Weather Center. All right, hopefully I can trim that right there, that little warble mistake that we made. We'll switch over here to the Adobe Editing View and trim out. Mm -hmm. All right, hopefully... Get rid of that. Scroll back to the front of the forecast. There it is, the top of the voiceover. Pull back. All right, line it up underneath the fade. Okay, let's find that mistake and do a little crossfade here. We might not be able to do this. It looks real tight. We'll see here. Gusty with a low temperature around 42 and sunny on Saturday, a high of 70. That's the latest look at the latest. That's a look at the latest weather information from right, that's the latest Saturday, look. a high of 70. That's the latest look at All right, 70. Zooming in very tight now. I'll pull this back so you can see a little bit more. Here we go. That's the latest. The latest. Here we go. Let's see what that says. Of 70. That's the latest look at 70. That's the latest look at the 70. That is right there. Let's zoom in a little bit. The word that, mm, I can't see it because it's so tight. This is that right here. This is that which was. Just going to zoom in real tight here that all right so we want right there that all right let's see if we can find another the next that that's a look at the latest okay that's the that's the next of that that we want 
it's hard to do this in just this this track view. Oh, so it's almost five. Trim right there. Let's see if that'll work. Might glitch. I'm not sure. We'll see. Pull back. Let's see. Okay, a high of 70. That's a look at the latest weather okay, information from right. the Wave Weather Center. Okay, that looks fine right there. We're perfect. Let's unmute the music bed. Wow. Bounce down and add uh, mastering and effects. Let's listen to the finished product here. See if you can tell that little glitch there where we trimmed off the mistake and added that's the latest look at the end. Here, listen up. From the Wave Weather Center, I'm Weatherbug Weathercaster John Gale. As we head into the evening, mostly clear skies expected, light and variable winds. Show you where it's at here. Our low temperature around 37. Sunny and chilly on your Friday, a high only reaching 59 with some gusting winds out of the west, northwest. Partly cloudy skies expected Friday night. Here we Still go. a bit gusty with a low temperature around 42 and sunny on Saturday, a high of 70. That's a look at the latest weather information from the Wave Weather Center. On Saturday, a high of 70. That's a look at the latest weather information from the Wave Weather Center. Ah, yes, the magic of editing. Isn't it wonderful? Isn't it wonderful what a little trim can do? A little trim. Speaking of trim, I don't know if you guys can tell. I'm, I'm Colonel Sanders. I'm trying a new thing. The wifey's not going to like it, but I, I'm kind of digging it. I've always wanted to have a little goat going. Let's see. I'll zoom in here. We'll go to the huge screen view and let you see my nasty goat. Let's see. I can't get my camera to uh, get out of the way of the mic stand here. Let me move the mic stand. There we go. Yes! You like that? What's the problem, Johnny G? You can't get in the frame? There we go. I don't know. I don't know. Need one of those little uh, Grecian formula things? We'll see. We'll see. We'll see how it turns out. I've always wanted one. We're going to try. Uh, I know, I'm getting old. But you know what? When you get old, you got to celebrate it, right? you got to celebrate it. I mean, come on. All right, so we've got our trims all trimmed up and ready to go. We're just going to add a fade here on the end. Just a little fade on the end of the jingle as the music begins. We need to have it fade out. All right, so there it goes. Let's listen to that. Looks good there. Let's scroll up to the front and trim off that. Mm -hmm. Real simple like Control Shift E. Oh, hello. The uh, shortcut to bring up the export file window, KULHFM. ADRs in the can, gonna overwrite it and uh, over, yeah, get rid of yesterday's. Celebrate, celebrate, Anita says, celebrate. Gotta celebrate getting old. Hey, you know, I've earned each and every one of these gray hairs. And on men, for some reason, I don't know, I don't know. Age is, is more kind to men than women. Not that I like getting old. I mean, nobody likes getting older. But for some reason, you know, you get some gray hairs on you as a man, it looks distinguished. You get gray hairs on you as a woman, and ooh, ooh, what the hell, oh my goodness. <laughs> Hey, you all H, I need to shut up. FTP, it's, the, it's that ATP. It's affecting my brain. On time, good job. We're going to move on. Yes, we should. To WQBRs overnight while we still have a chance. Pennsylvania, Scranton, and Altoona. This is an overnight read, a dry read first, and then we're going to do an overnight a dry read and an evening read as well. 20 seconds on the clock for this one airing, uh, let's see. Uh, it just says overnight. Here we go. 20 seconds. I know, I know, I know. Here we go. Here's the latest from WQBR as we head into the morning. <laughs> uh, all right, one more read. Here we go. Reset the clock. Here's the latest from WQBR as we head into the morning. A slight chance of some rain expected. Sprinkles by the afternoon. Cloudy skies and a high of 56. A chance of some light rain Friday night becoming mostly cloudy with a low temperature of 35 and sunny again on your Saturday with a high only reaching 58. Sunny on Saturday, a high of 58. I'm John Gale in the Bear Country Weather Center. All right, again, we're going to see if we can fix that, okay? Let's see what we can do. Trim it out. Here's the front. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Scroll back. Bounce down, add the mastering and effects here. Where is that mistake? With a low temperature of 35 and sunny again on your Saturday with a high only reaching 58. Sun All right, right here. All right, so right here, yeah, we'll get rid of this. Yeah, 
see what we got here. Zooming in a little bit tighter. Going right up to the voice. Right there. Delete. Now let's see what that's like. Sunny on Saturday, a high of 58. John Gale in the Bear Country Weather Center. 58, I'm John Gale in the Bear Country. I have 58, I'm John Gale in the Bear Country Weathers. Okay, I don't like that for some reason. Zooming in real, real, real tight. Let's get in tight. Here we go. The breath is where we want. We want the breath to stay in there. And this should look pretty good right over here. Let's zoom in tight on this side. Looks okay. We'll go back just a hair. Just a millisecond off. Scroll back. That's going to sound fine. Five. Sunny on Saturday, a high of 50. No, it doesn't sound right, does it? There, let's try that. It looks more natural. If sunny on Saturday, a That's high better. of 58. I'm John Gale in the Bear Country Weather Center. All right, looks good there. Let's go ahead. It took a little extra work, but it was worth it because we could, could save the voiceover that way. Just a millisecond of dead air on the very front side we want to take out so it triggers right on my voice when the uh, radio station needs to. And that gets us to close to a close to a 20. Let's go ahead and take out a little bit of this breath right here. And that gets us right beneath uh, 20 seconds, 19.8, which is perfect. All right, we're ready to send this to QBRs overnight. Just going to copy and paste and name it and claim it here. WQBR, FM, OV. Hit OK and overwrite yesterday's overnight forecast for QBR, the bear. And we'll look for it here in the E drive and send it on its way. All right, there she goes. On time, good job. Now we can do the evening edition weather for the same station, WQBR, FM. We'll keep this multi-track template session. We'll just delete the audio file, scroll back to the zero mark, and start our recorder again. 20 seconds again on the clock. Exact temperature reads. Here we go. Here's the latest from the Bear Country Weather Center for tonight. A chance of some light rain early on with some showers expected by morning. A low temperature of 47. More. Here's the latest. Ding. Here's the latest from the Bear Country Weather Center for tonight. A slight chance of some light. Mm -hmm. I'm having trouble today. Here's the latest from the Bear Country Weather Center for tonight. A chance of light rain early on with some showers expected by morning. Our low temperature around... <clears throat> Set around. Here's the latest from the Bear Country Weather Center for tonight. A light chance of rain expected. Doesn't sound good. Here's the latest from the Bear Country Weather Center for tonight. A chance of light rain early on, giving way to showers by morning. Our low temperature, 47 degrees. A chance of some sprinkles on your Friday afternoon with a high of 56. More rain expected Friday night, becoming cloudy with a low of 35. I'm John Gale from WQBR. And all that while, none of you guys said anything. My recorder wasn't recording. Life failure. Communication failure. Yeah, I know. Thanks, Hal. All right, this is it. One more read. Here's the latest. Here's the latest from the Bear Country Weather Center for tonight. A chance of light rain early on. Changing over to showers by morning. Our low temperature, 47 degrees. A slight chance of some sprinkles on your Friday afternoon under cloudy skies and a high of 56. More rain Friday night with a low of 35. I'm John Gale from WQBR. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Ooh, Jesus. Yeah. Mm -hmm, that last take, boy. Guys, I got to tell you, that last take was even better than the first. You know it was way better than the first. All right, here we go. We're going to trim off the ends here. Adding our mastering here. Let's listen to what we got. 
Here's the latest from the Bear Country. All right, I think I, un I did my multiband twice. Uh, yeah, I did. Okay, let's go back. Trim off all that. Mm -hmm. And this as well. Here's the latest from the Bear Country Weather Center for tonight. A chance of light rain. That doesn't sound like the compression's on it. One more. There we go. Here's the latest from the Bear Country Weather Center for tonight. A chance of light rain early on. Changing over to showers by morning. Our low temperature, 47 degrees. A slight chance of some sprinkles on your Friday afternoon under cloudy skies and a high of 56. More rain Friday night with a low of 35. I'm John Gale from WQBR. Yes, you are, Johnny GB. We're a little shy. We're a little over our uh, 20 mark by a couple milliseconds. So we're going to delete out a little breath there. We need one more breath trimmed. Let's find a good one. That one we just trimmed. This one we can trim. That should get us there to where we need to be. Indeed it is. Control shift E, the shortcut for WQBR to send this puppy to my E drive, finally. Those QBRs, they always give me grief. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. Every single day, the two QBR reads are my bane of existence. Uh, yes. But anyway, it's in the can. We're ready to roll. WQBR FM EV is what we want. Is that what we just saved? Let's make sure. We saved it correctly, WQBR. Today is the 15th, the 15th of October. Do you remember the 15th day of October? All right, WGNZ is up next in Fairborn, Ohio, a station close to me, physically about uh, 50 miles, maybe northwest. Yes, indeed. WQBR. WGNZ, rather. WGNZ, Tim Livingston's radio station, Southern Gospel Christian Talk format. We've got a uh, music bed there in track one of Adobe Audition. My voiceover highlighting in red in real time for track two. This is a 28-second read on the clock here. It airs this afternoon between 3 and 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We've got a different promotional close. So we need to be out by about 14 to 16 on the weather forecast. Here we go. Frost advisory in effect until 9 a.m. tomorrow. From the Miami Valley's 24-hour weather center as we head into the evening, that frost advisory in effect until 9 a.m. tomorrow. Otherwise, a chance of showers early on tonight. Patchy frost by morning with a low temperature of 34. That frost will burn off by 9 a.m. Friday, becoming sunny with a high of 56. The WGNZ Fall share is October 29th through the 31st. Plan now to join us or donate online now at WGNZ.com. I'm WGNZ staff weathercaster John Gale. Wow. Woo, thank you, Jesus. One take, Johnny G for WGNZ, and that was a hard read. Scrolling back to the front of the forecast here, switch to the Adobe Editing View here, trimming it up with the razor tool, getting rid of everything else, pull back the voiceover, line it up directly underneath the fade of the sticker. That's where it needs to start, right there. Unmute the music bed and bounce down both the audio files together as one. Combining them, the music and the voiceover, just a little bit of some overmodulation happening there. Let's add some mastering, some multiband compression settings, and broadcast effects, and let's take a listen. From the yes. Miami Valley's 24-hour weather center as we head into the evening, that frost advisory in effect until 9 a.m. tomorrow. Otherwise, a chance of showers early on tonight. Patchy frost by morning with a low temperature of 34. That frost will burn off by 9 a.m. Friday, becoming sunny with a high of 56. The WGNZ Fall share is October 29th through the 31st. Plan now to join us or donate online now at WGNZ.com. I'm WGNZ staff weathercaster John Gale. Good read there for WGNZ. Good. Control shift is E. Control shift E. Control shift E is what we need. Brings up the export file window. Let's uh, save it to the E drive here. Add in our extension dot. WGNZ AM ADR is in the can, overriding yesterday's forecast. Looking for it here in our E drive as an MP3 that we just saved it. And we can move on to New York. WKAL is going to be up next. WKAL is in Rome and Utica, New York, and in Oneida County. It is a news talk station. It plays Mark Levin and Sean Hannity, Rush Limbaugh, all those good guys there. WKAL has their own jingle bed. Let's close out this 
multi-track template session we just finished for Fairborn and open up WKALs that includes their jingle bed in track one. And let's start our recorder. My voiceover in track two, highlighting in red in real time. Uh, this one airs today between 3 and 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. 29 seconds on the clock. Let's see what we've got. Here we go. I'm John Gale with your official 1450 WKAL weather bug forecast. As we head into the evening, rain is likely with showers. Exp rain showers. Rain before 1 a.m., then showers likely after 1 a.m. Well, are not showers and rain kind of the same thing? I mean, you know, meteorologists, get a grip, will you? Reset the clock. Oh, let's give her another go. I'm John Gale with your official 1450 WKAL weather bug forecast. As we head into the evening, showers likely overnight with a low temperature around 47. More rain expected on your Friday afternoon, becoming cloudy with a high of 53. And showers likely early on Friday night, becoming partly cloudy with a low of 36. That's your latest official 1450 WKAL weather bug forecast. I'm John Gale, 1450 WKAL, more stimulating talk radio. Yes, indeedy. Yes, indeedy, Petey. Going to go ahead and trim it up. Trim it up, trim it out, trim it up, trim it up. Yay. There we go. Get rid of everything else. Scrolling back, the voiceover, lining it up directly underneath the music bed, bouncing down both the audio files together, adding the mastering and less audition. I'm John Gale with your official 1450 WKAL weather bug forecast. As we head into the evening, showers likely overnight with a low temperature around 47. More rain expected on your Friday afternoon, becoming cloudy with a high of 53. And showers likely early on Friday night, becoming partly cloudy with a low of 36. That's your latest official 1450 WKAL weather bug forecast. I'm John Gale, 1450 WKAL, more stimulating talk radio. Looks good there for WKAL. Just going to trim off the ends here, make it trigger right into the production from their automation computer. Control shift E brings up the export file. We're saving it now as an MP3 to WKAL, overriding yesterday's forecast. We will look for it and send it on its way to New York and move on to our next signal on the list, which is going to be in Florida, WZCC, I believe. WKAL's in the can. Let's go ahead and open that up. Hit that FTP button. Off she goes over the internet and it'll trigger then tonight, or rather this afternoon between three and six. Okay, yes, indeed. WZCC is up next. It's a dry read. No jingle behind me on this one. Just my illustrious golden-throated warbler. So we'll open just a dry template that has some denoise and some mastering on my microphone as we record in real time. This is for a country classic station airing today between 3 and 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, 30 seconds on the clock. Let's see what we get for Chiefland, Florida. Here we go. Starting our timer now. From the Broadcast Center, I'm John Gale with the Tri-Counties weather as we head into the evening. Partly cloudy skies with some calm winds. Our low temperature around 63. It'll be mostly sunny and warm on your Friday with a high near 88 and clear skies expected Friday night, a low of 62. Sunny again on your Saturday with a high of 83. Forecasts and current conditions are available 24-7 by clicking the Weatherbug logo at suncoastradio.com. I'm John Gale on Country Legends Radio. Okay, we're a little shy on this one, but it is a one-take Johnny GB. Yes, indeedy it is, he. Using the razor tool, we'll trim it up, and we'll probably do a digital stretch on this to get us right to the 30 that we need to be. Switching to the Adobe Large Screen View, we'll bounce down this audio file, adding some mastering and effects, and let's see. Zooming in real tight here. Trimming off the front end, and again here on the back end. Ah, yes. Yes, indeed. We're at 29.2. That is way too short. Too short, Johnny G. Let's go up to the favorites, to, uh, to the effects tab, rather, app up at the top. Scroll down near to the bottom, time and pitch, and then we want the stretch and pitch process. New duration, you guessed it, a 30. Delete everything else there. Hit apply. Boom shakalaka boom. Let's see what we got. From the broadcast center, I'm John Gale with the Tri Counties weather as we head into the evening. Partly cloudy skies with some calm winds. Our low temperature around 63. It'll be mostly sunny and warm on your Friday with a high near 88 and clear skies expected Friday night. 
a low of 62. Sunny again on your Saturday with a high of 83. Forecasts and current conditions are available 24-7 by clicking the Weatherbug logo at suncoastradio.com. I'm John Gale on Country Legends Radio. From the... All right, looks good. And Rosalie says, uh, hey, my friend, I'm in New North Carolina now, still viewing your program. Keep up the good work. We miss you, Rosa. And I have been watching you on Facebook and all of your great little encouragement, your words of encouragement. You need to keep that up, sister. You know why? It's good. Good stuff. And I mean it. And you're right about just not getting on to get on and do nothing. I saw your post and I thought, mm, she's wise. Just don't get on there to say nothing. People get on Facebook and they start their live streams and they think, you know, they're all that in a bag of chips. Well, you know what? Maybe it's best for you to keep your mouth shut until you got something to say. <laughs> Come on now. All right, WZCC's in the can. Sorry, I just felt like I needed to say that. And let's see. And that goes for me too, you know? Amen. I'm preaching to the choir. On time, good job. WZCC's all ready to roll. We're going to move on to Columbus, Ohio. Nelsonville WSEO is up next on the Radio Guy this Thursday edition as we do some live radio broadcast production. Uh, WSEO is a dry read. No jingle behind me on this one, just my voice. So we'll start that there and track one with some denoise and mastering. This is a 30-second read airing uh, this afternoon between 3 and 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for a country radio station, WSEO FM. Let's see what we got. Starting our timer now. Your weather bug forecast as we head into the evening. A chance of some showers expected by morning. Mostly cloudy skies. Our low temperature around 40. It'll be mostly sunny, chilly on your Friday, only reaching 57. Widespread frost expected Friday night. Clear skies, a low of 34. That frost will burn off on 9 a.m. Saturday morning, becoming sunny, a high only of 60 degrees, and partly cloudy Saturday night, a low of 46. This is Weatherbug Forecaster John Gale on WSEO. All right, my friends, that is a one-take read for WSEO FM. Country, Nelsonville, Ohio. Mm -hmm. Going to trim out the uh, voiceover work here from all my pontificating. And we will go ahead and bounce it down to its own audio file, adding some mastering and effects. Let's zoom in here and listen to it. Your weather bug forecast as we head into the evening, a chance of some showers expected by morning, mostly cloudy skies, our low temperature around 40. It'll be mostly sunny, chilly on your Friday, only reaching 57. Widespread frost expected Friday night, clear skies, a low of 34. That frost will burn off on 9 a.m. Saturday morning, becoming sunny, a high only of 60 degrees, and partly cloudy Saturday night, a low of 46. This is Weatherbug Forecaster John Gale on WSEO. Looking good there. Let's go ahead and trim out. Trim it up, trim it up, trim it up, trim it up. There we go. And this guy is ready to be exported to Columbus. WSEO is in the can. I'm going to name it and claim it here. Yes, indeedy. WSEO FM 80 are overriding yesterday's forecast because nobody cares about yesterday's weather in Columbus. We want to know what's going on today. There it is. As an MP3. And Glenn Goodwin says, Radio Guy, go bro. Go bro, Glenn Goodwin. <laughs> My buddy Glenn's in the house. We, uh, we're we old okay, K-Love buddies from EMF. The Educal, Educational Medical Hunaha Foundation. <laughs> On time, good job, and that is going to be the last forecast for today's edition of the Radio Guy. Glenn, I'm glad you jumped in there on the end and made me happy. I appreciate that greatly. Make sure you subscribe to us on YouTube. You can find us there. Just search for the Radio Guy. You'll see my little smiling face. Click on it. Click the channel. Good one on the radio. Check him out. Yes, indeed. Yeah, a little plug for my friend, Glenn. He has some very funny memes, if you like memes. But anyway, subscribe to us on, on YouTube, and you'll get notifications when we load up brand new content, just like you do when you follow us on Facebook, and you can check us out on social media. Some cool pics on Instagram now, the dot radio guy, the radio guy pretty much everywhere else. We're going to do it again tomorrow, Friday, the last day of the week at 1130 Eastern Standard Time, living the dream with Glenn Goodwin. Have a blessed rest of your day as all as well, Anita, and we'll see you all tomorrow morning. God bless y'all. Be safe. Remember, Jesus loves you. That's way, 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 way important to remember. Bye-bye.